Hello, Cancer. It's my lady from Ladies Way Tarot, and I'm coming to do your weekly reading for the week of 9 11 through 18 2017. The cards I am using today are Oracle of the Mermaid cards by Lucy Cavendish. And I close off with my Miss Cleo cards. I like to read those straight out of the book to ensure you get your full message. I want to thank everybody for like, share, subscribing, and setting up personal readings with me. If you want a personal reading, check in the description box below. Email me and we can set something up. Other than that, mm, let's get this show on the road. Okay, I feel like I'm forgetting something. All right, well, I'll get it later. Whatever it is. All right, what's going on with the... Cancer, 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 cancer. All right, you got a flipper. So, um, somebody might be having issues with infertility, or um, somebody may be um, uh, pu pushing you to um, have a baby or get pregnant. Okay. All right, what's going on? What's going on, Cancer? Mm, okay, so you got a story here. So, it's something going on with uh, work. Either the situation hasn't been going on for a long time. Or you just haven't had this job for a long time. But something is slowing it down. Like somebody probably taking your... Maybe you've been doing a job or something and somebody been taking their time to pay you. Like they haven't been paying you like they should, okay? All right, let's... Jeez, cancer. All right, so there's a situation where somebody doesn't. Oh, so here, the, dude, y'all got a lot of stories going on. It's a whole lot of strong energies out here. So in this situation, somebody is not wanting to be with somebody, but somebody is gonna try to have a baby with them. Somebody's gonna try to get pregnant by them. Okay. Or, or somebody's trying to start a relationship with somebody who doesn't want them. Okay. All right. Mm, mm, mm. All right. Cancer, cancer, cancer. What's going on for the cancer? Love reading. 9, 11 through 9, 18. Cancer, love reading. 9, 11 through 9, 18. Look at this. I got to rewatch this one because I don't know how that card flipped out like that. Oh, Jesus. All right. So it seems like somebody has been dealing with their ex and that is about to come out. Ooh. I feel like they've been doing it with a long, for a long time. For some of you, it's been happening for a long time, and they start actually caring about their ex. And then for others of you, I feel like um, this might be a child's parent. Like somebody's dealing with the child's parent again, okay? All right. The cards won't let me deal. All right, Cancer, 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 9-11, July 18, 2017. Cancer, Cancer, Cancer. All right. So, somebody is not giving. I feel like offers being turned down or just like um you feel like you're being used or you are being used. All right. Wow. So, somebody is telling you they are using you too. I feel like or just making it obvious. I don't feel like it's just not I don't who I feel like somebody is like if you're going to be with me, you're going to give me stuff. This could be you or this could be the person you're dealing with. I mean, vice versa. Either way, general reading. So, uh, this seems like it might be a work situation as well. If I feel like, um, wow, it seems like somebody might be extorting a boss. Like, okay, we've been together. You're going to give me what I want or I'm going to tell on you. That's what I'm feeling like here. That's what I'm feeling like here. Okay. Yeah, uh, in this reading, I'm feeling like it might be you, Cancer. You might be the one who is doing the extorting. And it seems like, I just heard jackpot. It seemed like somebody found the person that they want to, uh, I guess I'm going to say manipulate. Yeah, that's what I'm seeing. I'm sorry. I mean, it could be being done to you, though. Because it's a general reading, so it's 
either you the predator or the prey here all right so it seems like the person who is doing all this they violating um personal space they don't care they do whatever they feel like doing they're like you gonna do this and that's just what's gonna happen there's nothing you're gonna do about it i got everything i need you know that's what this situation is like if you don't do what i tell you i'm telling all right, yeah, so, I mean, just basically the same thing. They're giving you gifts and stuff, you know. I don't know what they did. Um. All right, let's see what this honesty, what is this honesty card about? What's going on? What's going on? But I feel like you might be pregnant by him or, I mean, just started a relationship with him or some him or her, whatever. All right, so this is just, I mean, you're dealing with, you're going to be honest about some kind of arrogant figure. About what? What is this going on? Cancer, cancer, cancer. Mm. Okay, so this just makes me feel like a relationship. You know, I feel like somebody just going to be honest about a relationship. Somebody uh, maybe young and beautiful. And then we got this arrogant figure who think they uh, belong. They deserve everything, and I feel like somebody's going to spread us, spill the beans about it. Yeah, so now there are some sacrifices to be made. Mm. Oh, yep, sexual relationship. So it's like after you have sex with this person, if you haven't already, they're going to get you. Okay? Oh, man. All right, so what's going on for the cancer? I think I... Ooh deceitful lying dishonest and it seems like you guys might even be ended up in court you could be dealing with an aries or a fire sign any kind of mm. yeah so i think these are the two parties this is the boss and this is the that worker that got in where where they fit in get in where you fit in kind of thing. cancer 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 what's going on in the love reading Love reading for cancer 9 11 through 9 18 2017. Cancer, cancer, cancer. Wow, like every one of my readings started with this today with the Cleo cards. It's like a whole bunch of communication. But to me, this card means somebody is acting like they love you. They're trying to make you feel like uh, you're special. But in reality, you see that cup on the top? I feel like it's perishable, whatever they're saying. Mm. Hmm. Okay, so it looks like, uh, all right, let me just read out the book. All right, first we have the Eight of Cups. Eight of Cups is upright. It says, it may be time to move on and start new plans. Do not let your pride stop you from making a change. So it's basically like whatever you were planning on before this person started um, extorting you, do it anyway. If you don't want to deal with them, take off. You know, it's like, don't let this person stop you. Because I feel like this person could be um, could be in trouble, too, for whatever this situation is. I don't feel like you're the only one that's going to be at fault. All right, so staffs, staffs. Page of staffs. Where is it? All right, it says, a good person, but sometimes egotistic. Um, something, someone may bring you important news, listen to it, it's a truthful person. So basically, somebody about to come tell you something that's going to help you get out of this situation, okay? I don't know, maybe the person you're dealing with is known for this, or maybe you're dealing, I mean, you're known for doing this, and the person just found out, like, about a previous employer or something. All right. So we have the Eight of Swords reversed. Eight of Swords, Eight of Swords. And do you do emotional, no, public embarrassment at the hand of others. A feeling of being held prisoner, trapped by some force. A situation difficult to escape from. Yeah, I feel like it's difficult to escape from, but I feel like you're going to get away. Once you get this news, you, you, 
you're going to be embarrassed. You know, you can't have from that, but you're going to get away from it. All right, so nine um, of swords. A distinct... Mm, a distinctive indication of past problems with law enforcement present um, and necessary. Dang, so it seemed like this stuff may end up going to court. I feel like in the past, this person dealt with this stuff in the court already. But I don't know. It's, I'm got sort of gotten the feeling that you don't have nothing to worry about. You know, just get out of your head about it and just let things happen. You you're gonna be you're gonna be all right or the person that you're doing this to or if it's this you doing this you better watch out because you're gonna end up getting in trouble all right so we got the four cups four of cups is reversed um a precursor of, of things to come a chance to increase your skill and knowledge so yeah i think core to do that but that's all i have for you guys make sure to check your sun moon and rising signs if you want a personal reading, check in the description box below. Email me. We can set something up. Other than that, um, make sure to check your sun, moon, and rising signs. I said that. I wanted to say, uh, if you can, find somewhere to donate to um, the people affected by these hurricanes. Uh, what is it? Irma, Jose, and Andrew. You know, let's um, try to, I mean, if we can't send any money, let's pray for these people, you know? All right. That's all I have for you guys. Make sure to check everything and have a great week.